Okay, so this is um, also Tuesday, the Tuesday, January, I mean, January, June 2nd. This is my afternoon walk. Uh, if you remember from my my morning walk, um, there was a disc golf across the, the, the road from where we were. So I followed the disc golf. Um, yeah, I followed the disc golf, um, or part of the disc golf course um uh when i did the walking so th this time i had a little bit more um of guidance rather than in the what um happened in the morning the rather than my walk in the morning okay so these are just um some of the flowers that were um actually in the main campsite where we were more of those flowers. I just thought they were very pretty. Some were, you know, just buds and some were actually blooming. And again, you know, I just, as I said, I just liked them. And I just got them at different angles and everything. And another. Another angle of those same flowers. Okay. So this is where the shower house for those who were, um, Take it, you know, would do um, those who are camping out and everything, and um, they were very lukewarm baths because um, my youngest went to go take the shower in there, and he's like, It's very lukewarm. But from what I was told, they were like, nice looking in there, they just weren't very warm. And then you see that red car that is a, another camp site, um, there, that's one of the few places that people were actually staying. There's only a couple of, you know, couple groups. Okay. Shower house. Okay. So this is a sign. Um, I don't remember what the exact sign said. It doesn't matter, but it had um, a bird's nest in it. So I took a picture of it. I think it was talking about the, the paintball um, store. I think that's what it was. So we were just down the street from the paintball. Okay, some more flowers. I just like how wispy they look. Okay. Um, I, ooh, why is the, okay. Um, I, I took a picture of this just because I was actually, there's several pictures, but I'm not showing all of them. I was playing around with um, the camera and everything. Okay, so you see the path that um, you walk in to get um, to the the golf, uh, mini golf area. And so then there's these different stations and everything. So this is one of the stations. So this look, it's like, it's number seven. Okay, and more of those rocks that I told you guys about in the first one, there's more of them. And then this random plant that was in the middle of the path. So, and I thought it was pretty cool, especially with the shininess and everything, you know, and then some more, some a close up of the the plant. Um, you can barely see it, but there is actually a mat right there, and that mat is for um, for you to stand on. So when you think about when you play mini golf, you have that the um, place where you putt or, putt from, and um, this is like where you stand to throw the disc. Here's one of the trees on the path. Just you're know, playing um, disc golf in the, in the middle of these trees. Okay, and you saw this on the front slide. And this um, um, tree branch, our tree trunk, had fallen, but it couldn't fall all the way. It landed in another tree, and the only way I was able to get the whole picture was to do it side or like cockeyed a little bit just so that um, you could see the whole, how big it was. Okay, so here's another one of the, um, yeah, the um, disc golf thingies. I can't think right now. Stations, close up of it. 
And then this tree had like little, it was just interesting. It didn't have like the like big thick branches. It had small branches with the um, leaves coming out. And I thought it was pretty cool. Here's a close up of it, you know what I'm talking about. It looks like more like um, what you would think of with uh, flowers and plants. Okay, so it's showing you where the different, you know, which, so there, there was two different courses. There was a blue one and a white one, and it was just showing you the directions of which direction you needed to go um, to play the golf. Okay, more of the trees. Okay, so then I ran across this sign, posted, and it was supposed to be facing the other direction, okay? Um, because what I, so this is where we were staying was at the Ace Adventure Center um, in Oak Hill, West Virginia. As I said, it had fallen off whatever it was supposed to be because it, this was at the property line, and I just went a little tiny bit, and it butts up to these um, houses and these different, and the farms and everything. So that's why the sign's there. Okay, so I'm back on the path and everything. And then we saw, I saw so many of these, um, I think they're swallowtail. I don't know if I'm right or not. Um, these butterflies flying around. Um, and so this one landed like right by where um, I was walking and everything. So I was able to get a shot of it. I have a couple shot, um, pictures of it. And then I the plant that it landed on has thorns and it some of the piece of it fell and I tri or when I was trying to take a picture I was not paying attention like I should have been and I ended up um, walking over tripping over the thorny parts of the one that piece that fell down or um, came off or whatever so I ended up with a cut on my calf um, because of that some more of the butterfly. It's moving its wings. That's why it's not completely in focus. Okay, so some more of the flowers around there. Some more of them. Okay, more of the course and everything. So now we're up to number 13. I didn't go all the way to number um, 18. Some of the flowers and everything. Okay, so now this is um, like the, these are similar to the ones you saw in the first first uh, first few slides. I can't speak right now. Okay, so this is back at the campground and everything. And um, right behind this um, conifer is where um, the boys in, well, actually to the left. Yeah, actually to the left is where the boys were going to camp. And then um, directly, if you just kept going straight and there's like a one of the um, dra a gravel driveways um, to get into the camp. And then it's um, the boys. So this is like directly towards where the boys were sleeping. And then this is um, one of the driveways. And I think, if I'm correct, this is the one like leaving where the boys were sleeping. And, or is it the, I don't know. Because there was two different ones. There was one right before where they slept and then one right after. So it was one of those two. And... The one where they were sleeping, um, or right before it, that's usually the one my husband took out to go when he, you know, when they had to go to the welcome center to go white water rafting and whatnot. Um, but when my niece and I left, we took the one to the other side. She's like, where are you going? Same, going the same direction, but um, she had not walked um on, on that one um, or written on that one so she was like a little confused okay so this is the um, end of this walk um, my next video is going to be uh, when 
we dropped the boys or the boys and my niece off at uh, the water park and then we went over to get gas and to the welcome center um not the welcome the over well it is like sort of the welcome center but you can't get actually go get in there right now but um the uh boardwalk slash overlook of the new river gorge uh, and then we came back and got them. Uh, they all stayed together. They were, you know, teenagers. They were fine. Um, but that's the next video. And then after that is going to be a video um, about um, the uh, under the bridge walk. Um, when we walked on the catwalk and everything. And then I made break it down into two because we were on, under the bridge for about an hour and a half or so. And then we went into Fayetteville, um, West Virginia, for uh, to get our lunch before we're heading out. Um, so I might break that one into two. Um, probably am. Um, I don't have any pictures on the way home. Um, so, okay. Talk to you later. Bye.